Hey, what is up everybody? Okay, so it has actually been quite a while since I've uploaded any Fahong videos. I don't know why, I've just been very distracted at Apex. <laughs> but I have been working on it in the background, you know, like playing here and there. And it's been quite a journey on how much I've actually progressed in this game. And all the new things I've discovered, like this game is actually endless when it comes to the discoveries. And because of that, I actually wanted to start uploading more my home videos, you know, get back on the my home uploading track. <laughs> but so I thought, you know, maybe the best way to do that would be to, you know, introduce what I've discovered so far and just show you around my land and we could start from there, you know, this will be the first up video, uploaded back. And if you're new to the channel, I will leave a link to a playlist if you do want to see all of my other uploads that I've made about Valm. I know I made like three videos, a live stream or two. You can watch the beginning of it, how it all started and, you know, basically, you'll even see on the live stream me building my house from the ground up. But in the video I didn't finish it, but here it is completely finished. And I'm gonna take you through a nice walkthrough of my land. I'm gonna show you all the nice little nooks and crannies that I have slowly discovered throughout this game. <laughs> Like, uh, we'll start with just, you know, the outside, the land itself. So, apparently in this game you can farm. Currently I'm farming carrots and carrot seeds. <laughs> and you can tame animals. Currently I just tamed these, captured the balls yesterday. So, they're not exactly tamed yet. They're still a little bit, you know, rough around the edges. <laughs> And this, I think, was hands has been hands down my greatest discovery is this building that I have created. This magnificent, this, my people, is a portal. Yes, you heard it. You can actually get portals in the home, which is kind of insane and epic at the same time. But it's kind of funny how these portals work. They're more of a two-way sister portal kind of system you have to have this portal and you have to have a secondary portal <coughs> but luckily you can have multiple portals and as long as you name the portal then you can use this one just to get from place to place like currently it's set to the black forest which is all the way over here if I have to go through it then of course you know I'll come up the other side in the black forest Voila, now we're in the black forest. All the way from here to here. <laughs> but it's, it's, it does mean you go to like, you know, discover the land and place a portal, but it's still pretty awesome because like, for example, now I've discovered, I recently sailed to uh, the swamplands, which is pretty big, but it's a problem because now sailing from there to my island from this island to my island is quite dangerous because there is actually a lot of sea creatures in between and anything can happen to me like this if i die this side i get respawned back to my house then i have to rebuild a boat gather all the resources rebuild another boat just to go get back to my body so i think you know the portal system works really well because no matter what if i die just take my portal yeah, go back to the swamplands and everything is okay. And we even made a cart. Yes, it's a usable cart to get. Check. <laughs> it's kind of cute. Like you walk around with it. I mainly use the cart just for like mining and stuff. Which is very useful. I got like, you know, a whole bunch of scrap things I find inside the black forest. And we are even built a nice little boathouse for myself. I'm quite proud of this little boathouse, you know. I got my 
sailing boat for you know the long voyages in the ocean and then I still got my little raft you know just for sailing along the river line mm. and then yeah you know some basic it's like basic necessities and just you know simple lifestyle <laughs> but I really I've been having so much fun with my home it's actually this game is really cool it's really epic and now we shall take you to the grand tour of my house. Now this house alone took me quite a while to build. Like there was so much that went into building this house. Like oh it was it was work. Like <laughs> I'm not gonna even lie, it was work to build this house and to just to get everything together like it was just it was a nightmare. Okay, so we got the entrance hall, you know, I got some nice trophies set up, a uh, troll that I killed, and a drake trophy. A drake, if you want to know what a drake is, that's actually some flying creature that lives in the snowy mountains. I have not yet discovered the full depth of that mountain because it is so dangerous up there, <laughs> but, you know, I'm actually going to make a video when... A video about it that I actually explore the entire depth of the mountain as you like to see I like to explore everything and map out the whole land and I'm gonna do the exact same thing with the snowy, snowy mountains that I did with the black forest to map it all out because I like to know everything is you know I like no surprises okay so we'll start with my weapons room yes I build a weapons room you know, I got some interesting stuff. Got like a sword, shield, a bone hammer. I don't know. That like bone hammers are very great for fighting the skeletons. If you're in the beginning of the game and uh, you need to fight skeletons in the Black Forest, a bone hammer gets them every time. Like it's the best weapon you can get. And you know, a nice dining table. It's, you know, when we just want to uh, have some dinner and chill out. <laughs> and then. This like grey dwarf shaman trophy is actually kind of creepy because sometimes when I walk past it he'll talk to me. It's it's weird, it's disturbing but it's still pretty cool because he's green and he glows so we keep him on the wall. <laughs> and here's the kitchen, you know, we got our nice cauldron, we can make some soups, some meats and we got our fermenter, you know, to our cooking station just to fry up some meat, all that stuff, my fridge so to speak <laughs> so really you know and then i have my bedroom it's very small you know modest bedroom with a nice fireplace and one of the best trophies i have is one of the heads of one of the bosses i actually had to kill him twice to get this trophy because the first trophy head you have to put it on the stone over here to in to gain its power so then i wanted a trophy so i went back and I killed him again just so I could get the trophy it was a lot of work just for a trophy and then you know this is just the basic storage room you know got a whole bunch of stuff in here like some gems gold more trophy heads uh, a whole bunch of other stuff and a dragon's egg which is kind of epic I got a dragon egg yes I do <laughs> I'm part of the cool kids now I got a dragon egg <laughs> uh, but yeah and I just got my basement left, you know. Uh, now the basement was kind of complicated to build. Now, my basement is basically just my workshop, you know. I got my forge to make all my metal weapons, you know. I got my cultivators, all my copper knives. I have my workbench that makes my common stuff, you know. Some simple stuff, my bows, you know, things like that. And, of course, the smelter that will make smelt ore into, you know, proper materials. And then we've got a little storage unit, you know, for some simple resources that we need around the crafting benches and stuff like that. I've still yet not figured out what the hell this amber is. Like, I have found so much amber, I don't even know what to do with it, because I don't know what the hell it is. And then, <laughs> you know, it's crazy. And then we got a nice little upstairs. I haven't figured out what to do with the upstairs yet. Like, I'm still working on that. Right now, I'm just using this as a chest to store my 
bronze bars and my silver bars and you know some bronze nails and a little bit of obsidian but I have not yet figured it out what I'm actually gonna do with the upstairs it's still a mystery and yeah come it's actually funny compared to how my house used to look like the first house I built was so depressing compared to this like I have come a really long way and I've progressed so much in this game that it's actually insane and to think that I have ex I've spent days maybe a few weeks exploring just all of this and I have not even begun to touch the surface of this planet <laughs> you know it's crazy it's crazy to think on how much more I'm gonna figure out how much more I'm gonna find out like I'm technically still in the beginning of the game and I already have discovered how to build portals, you know? It's crazy <laughs> to think how much more I can actually progress into this game and how much further it's gonna go. But I think they actually do want to really start uploading more about Valhalla again because this game is really fun and I really do enjoy it, you know? But yeah, <laughs> I just want to like, you know, make a short video and show you about the comings of my new life in my home and how much I've actually progressed in this game and everything that it's become of my plot when it was just a foundation when I started on like on the live stream it was just a power I was just building the foundation and some walls but now I built a castle for myself <laughs> and I have cultivated land worthy of myself but yes <laughs> soon next video we are going to be making a video about exploring the snowy mountains i want to see what's up there like proper you know there's like wolves there's these flying creatures that spit ice at you and that's so far what i oh and there's like these weird crazy troll thingies now made out of stone i still not yet figured out how to defeat one Apparently you need a pickaxe to defeat them, so that's going to be interesting to try and fight a troll that I need a pickaxe to f A stone troll that needs a pickaxe to be killed <laughs> But anyway, <clears throat> I hope that you enjoyed the video and if this is your first for home video of me that you're watching I suggest going to the playlist It will be in the description and it will be in the top corner Maybe go watch the start you can see how my journey began and to where it is now and yeah, I'll see you guys around. Bye.